Welcome to another DK engineering inspection video. And today, uh, hiding away from the rain actually, we have a, uh, a 2015 Porsche Cayman GT4. Uh, being a 2015 car is of course a uh, 981 generation. And for the eagle eyes amongst us, uh, they would have immediately noticed that this is of course the uh, highly regarded club sport uh, Cayman GT4. So it has those uh, lovely extras that make the car that bit, it gives them a bit of the edge over the, uh, over the standard cars, if you will. I will note straight away that the car is on a private registration that will be retained as part of the sale, uh, but for, this, for the purpose of it being uh, searchable online on the uh, various DVLA websites, etc., um, the car is on its private plate as it, uh, as it is still registered to this day. But during the sale, it will be reverted back to its age-related age plate. So touching on the topic of uh, club sport, we can immediately note from the outside that it is indeed fitted with the uh, PCCB brakes, uh, of course front hand brake, um, which is of course the carbon ceramic option, as you can see uh, inscribed there. And then giving a quick look into the interior, you'll also find it is equipped with these uh, carbon fiber bucket seats that you would find typically in a uh, 918 Spider, And then we have this uh, harness as well, but at the same time you have the option to use the uh, to use a seat belt should you wish. We additionally have the roll cage in the back there. Really helps focus this car into, uh, into the driver's car that it, that it really is. And of course we have that all important six speed manual gearbox. Uh, this car has been in the possession of its single owner since 20, uh, 2015, when it was supplied new, um, and today presents with just under 5,000 miles uh, from new, and has been very well looked after throughout its life, as you, as you can probably tell by the condition of this car. Um, there are a few bits that I will go into around the car that, uh, that for full disclosure, should be noted. For example, there is a small scuff in the front bumper here. But other than that, we have the few areas where it's been seen some scrape on the uh, on the front. But to be honest with you, it's a um, very clean car, uh, and well, it's only done five thousand miles, so you wouldn't really expect much less. It's just had new tyres fitted on the front, riding on the Michelin Pilot Sport Cup twos. Those are stamped with a twenty twenty three date. If we can find it. Can you see that? So those are the front tyres. And then on the back, with about five, five millimetres tread left on both sides, it's also fitted with Pilot Sport Cup 2s. Uh, and these tyres are dated to 2015, but as I say, with um, lots of use left in them still. So this example has been well serviced throughout its life, um, however we, we do note that the car is due a service late in 2023. Just showing the condition of the car here, generally being in very good condition indeed. None of the wheels have any curb damage as well, I'll quickly take a look at all of those to show you that. And the final wheel back here. And we'll head into the interior now where there are some signs of use that I will uh, point out right away. We have some uh, imprints there. Shouldn't be from when the, uh, the belt has gone into the, into the buckle and been missed. There is one small tear in the leather. If you can see just that. Other than that, the interior presents in very good condition, and as you can see there, the mileage of 4,873 from new. This car is also equipped on the interior with this uh, carbon fiber, which you find on the door, uh, door panel, on the interior here, along the center console, and if 
funny where you have the cup holders as well. And being a, a club sport, you actually have the uh, fire extinguisher as well. Door sills all in good condition. And while some around here, I'll pop these two. The Cayman may be considered a smaller car in Porsche's arsenal, but when you uh, reveal the reveal the front, you actually have quite a generous space as far as modern supercars are concerned, or if you will, sports cars, whatever you would like to call it. Very reasonable space there to go um, to go away for the weekend and pack quite some luggage with you. And then we'll go around to the rear of the car where you can see not much of the engine, but worth showing. I say not much, but in reality it's nothing. But you do actually have some more storage space, not like, not like you'd find in a 911. So this car will be going live on a DK engineering auction powered by car owner. You can find everything you need within this listing and please do refer to the document section to, uh, to view the history summary for this car. But to summarize, it's a uh, well-optioned single owner from new 2015 Porsche Cayman GT4. And uh, we wish you happy bidding. Thank you for watching.